And hello from the Heldenstadt, as it's known, the city of heroes. The venue is the Red Bull Arena. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and my partner, ready to bring you all the analysis and technical talk, is Stuart Robson. And on this day of fireworks displays for many, we hope to bring you plenty of crackling action. It's RB Leipzig against Borussia Dortmund. Well, thanks, Derek. Yeah, I'm expecting plenty of fireworks on the pitch, at least from the players. It should be a good game, though. I'm looking forward to this one. And this confrontation is underway. Well, let's have a look at the starting 11 for Leipzig. Peter Gulacci is the goalkeeper of choice. Angelino plays with Nordi Mukiele in the fullback positions. Marcel Zabitza plays alongside Kevin Campbell in central midfield. And Andre Silva is the lone striker. Turning inside, where's he going to go? Not fantastic defending. Let's see if it helps the opposition. And introducing the Borussia Dortmund side. Mats Hummel starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence and so many different ways to configure an attack in this case it'll be two men up front can he give them the lead and that would have been quite the early boost for them well it may be early in the game Derek but that chance has to be taken it's a poor finish And he's taken it away. Must take the lead here. And turned onto the woodwork. And he did what he had to do defensively. Can he put it away? And a goal! Now they have their opener. And now they can celebrate. Well, here's the goal again, and it's a great ball to put him through. Good vision to set up the chance, and the timing of the run is just as good. As for the finish, it was never in doubt. And the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? They need to get tighter. Mukiele just cutting off the supply. Meunier. Excellent defending. Having won the ball back, they might be able to profit. And this is Royce. Oh, it's in for Borussia Dortmund. It is going their way. Well, here you can see it again. Good run, great strength and a composed finish under pressure. That's a top-class goal. So 2-0 now. Leipzig moving the ball forward. What can they do from here? Kampel! Well, the bar can be the goalkeeper's best friend. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Well, I have to say, I thought that looked to be going in. It was such a good effort. It might still be problematic. Well, that's the end of that for now. 
And the counter looks on here. Options available. And that'll be offside. Simakon. Can they take advantage? And he read it well. Wonderful challenge and a throw in coming up. Manuel Akanji. And wasteful from Dortmund. Nkunku. Well, as you can see, Leipzig have had most of the ball, but they are. Now, hold enough. on, Stuart. They're in here. Guerrero. It's there for him. Well, he really wants his brace. Well, he looks so bright today. His movement has been excellent. And the right place to cut out the pass. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Well, an honest assessment, Stuart, would be that he hasn't really been on top of his game and attack. Well, he has to find space in more dangerous areas. He's such a good player around the box, but today he struggled to get on the ball, and that's one of the reasons they're losing here. And off and running again. There was a real gulf in class in the first 45. Will we see an improved effort from Leipzig in the second? Rice. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And Bellingham. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Bodies forward and the break looks on. They need to get bodies back. Could pull one back here. And he does! He's thrown his team a lifeline. The belief is back. Well, just look at this again. The speed of counter-attack is so impressive. And the finish is just as good. That's an excellent goal. So uh, back underway. Intriguing contest this, given the 2-1 scoreline. Reina has it. What can they do from here? Well, the counter chance looks very real. Marcel Zabitza. Andres Silva. Determined defending. And they've given him too much space. Dahoud. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Marcel Zabitza. On to Forsberg. It's gone out of play for the Dortmund throw-in. Daniel Malen. Now Holland. Dahoud. Erling Holland. 
An incisive pass. Will it happen for them? And a goal it is. They lead by two now. Fully deserved. Well, here's the goal again, and what a wonderfully weighted pass this is. And it makes the striker's job so easy. All he has to do is make the right connection. It's a lovely goal. So they get the ball moving again. 3-1 the scoreline here. What's going to happen next? Twenty minutes to go in this one. And scope for them to produce something exciting. But they dealt with the threat posed. Zabita! And what a magical save it was! Well, that's woken up these fans. They haven't had too much to cheer about so far. And Dortmund will go to the bench. Played over. And they deal with the threat this time. Fifteen minutes left for play. And fed forwards. And he could really get at the opposition. Axel Witzel. And that pass could be troublesome. And possession given away. Andre Silva. So Bosloy. Here's Mukiele. Forsberg. And after that fantastic effort, it's gone out for a throw-in. Substitution it is for Dortmund. Well, possibilities in the centre. Oh, they've lost it. Using his strength to shield the ball. Andre Silva. Not the pass he had in mind. Space afforded him. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Dahoud. Chance here. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Well, I love this finish. No messing about. He just hits through the back of the ball with such power. That's a good goal. And there goes the final whistle. No points picked up by Leipzig at all, much to the disappointment of their supporters. Well, Derek, that just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. Well, a spectacular contribution from Julian Brandt. It really was eye-catching. What did you make of his overall performance, Stuart? Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.